back to 13 News Now at noon. Next weekend, Hampton Roads Philharmonic will celebrate Beethoven's 250th birthday and showcase some of the talent from their Young Artist Competition. So joining me now to tell us all about the show, we have Hampton Roads Philharmonic's music, direct, music director, there we go, words, Stephen Brindle, and we also have Eliza Willett, the grand prize winner from the Young Artist Competition. Thank you so much for being here. Very excited to see you. And welcome to the show, Eliza. Congratulations. Thank you. We'll Thank talk you. to Eliza in just a moment. But first, start us off just talking about um, the show itself and how you're celebrating Beethoven's birthday. Sure. So we're the Hampton Roads Philharmonic, um, and we're a community orchestra based here in the community. Primarily, we pay, uh, play in Hampton. Uh, we've been around for about seven years now. Okay. Um, and for this performance, it's our Young Artist Competition Showcase. So uh, our Young Artist winner is going to be our, our main focus. But in, for a little hat tip towards Beethoven's uh, 250th anniversary, we're performing his uh, second symphony. Not one of his okay. most well-known, but it's a really awesome and engaging piece. Very nice. You were saying you've done this Young Artist Competition for what, four years now? Four years, yeah. We've had young soloists play with us in the past, um, and we wanted to formalize it into an actual competition to give um, young performers the opportunity to do it, so we kind of made it into an official event that's going to be happening every year from here on out. That's awesome. Eliza, you have to tell us yes. how you prepared for this and, and kind of what was going through your mind during the entire competition. Give us a rundown. Sure. <laughs> so my main focus is slow practice. Okay. Before I, I play and going into any concert, it's just slow, it calms, calms my heart rate down and just makes me feel really pre prepared for the, for the concert. That's awesome. For any kind of aspiring you know, young musicians out there, in addition to that advice, what else would you tell them to get ready for a competition such as this? I would say know your piece very well in advance so you feel totally comfortable before, before playing. Very nice, wonderful advice. So Stephen, tell us exactly how people could get involved, say maybe next year they want to become the next Eliza, mm -hmm. how can they do that? Uh, you can find our information online and through social media, so hrphil.org or Facebook, if you do that, you can search Hampton Roads Philharmonic there. Um, and we publish the information for next year's competition uh, well in advance, our date's already set for the upcoming fall, so we'll hold a competition this November for the performance, which will be the following year after that. So social media, online, all that stuff. Or come to a concert. Or come to a concert. Don't forget that <laughs> yeah. for sure. We have about 30 seconds left. Eliza, I meant to ask you, so your, your instrument of choice, tell me about this. Yes, this is a German Roth violin. I've, I've had it for about 10 years now. A very warm tone. I, I love it. Yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> you, you'll have to kind of give me a rundown a little bit later of all the different types because you see it yeah. and you know if you're not a, a musician you don't necessarily know that for sure but it, it just looks very comfortable in your hands. It there. is. It very is. nice <laughs> to meet you and thank congratulations you. Stephen. Thank you so thank much. Thank you for having us. We'll have all this information too on 13newsnow.com and we'll be right back. <laughs> 